Korea's former president Park Geun-hye is back home this lunchtime following a marathon questioning by prosecutors and an hours-long review of her statement. She left the prosecutor's office in Seoul with her lawyers just over five hours ago now after spending 21 hours there. Park did not say anything to reporters as she got into her waiting vehicle and just smiled at her supporters upon her arrival back at her residence. All eyes now are on the prosecutor's Next move, Kim Hyo Sun starts us off. Former President Park Geun Hye returned to her private residence in Samsung Dong, southern Seoul, early Wednesday morning after 14 hours of questioning by prosecutors and several more hours reviewing her statements. The review took longer than expected as Park is facing so many charges and because she refused to have the interrogation session videotaped or audio recorded. Prosecutors now have to determine, based on their investigation and park statements, whether to issue a warrant for her arrest. Prosecutor General Kim Soo Nam is going to review the results of the interrogation and make a decision soon. No one knows exactly what the prosecution plans to do, as they said their primary focus right now is on the interrogation and ensuring it's carefully reviewed. Some within the prosecutor's office believe an arrest warrant is inevitable, given the fact that a number of Park's aides at the presidential office, as well as Samsung Electronics Vice Chairman Lee Jae-yong, were arrested on similar charges. On the other hand, some also think an arrest warrant won't be issued, given that it could affect the May 9th presidential election, which is less than 50 days away. Kim Yo-san, Arirang News.